Hello everyone, welcome back to our video, and uh, in today's video, I'm going to be making a part 2 to uh, what if, not what, what the hell am I talking about, uh, why Jack Pacific makes the best Sonic figures, um, totally not just because the last one blew up, um, but mainly because I got some new figures, yeah, uh, these two classic ones, Mighty and Sonic, those ones are kind of old, but these three in the middle, I literally got them today at Walmart, but let's just get into it, enough you happen. So first off, we're going to start off with probably, like, my least favorite figure that I have here today, and that is Flicky. Uh, he comes with this nice golden ring. Uh, I might buy, unless you can get these rings with other figures, I might buy a few Flickies. And use these, give them one to Vector. Once I get Charmy and Espy, I'll give one to them. And uh, maybe if Knuckles and Mighty have grab, have like holding hands, and that as well. But anyway, uh, back onto the figure. Uh, yeah, we got Flicky. So, uh, hang on, I'm gonna move the camera. So, yeah, Flicky. It's a. Uh, yeah, it's okay. I mean, you don't really get that much movement. You get head swivel all the way around. Uh, hand movement and movement here. But, might as well just keep it like that. Now this guy is super tiny. Here is a Sonic for comparison. And he is actually, like, he's only the size of a classic figure's body. I would grab one, but I don't want to reach all the way up there just to grab one but uh yeah he's like the size of a body of them so i can't really put that much articulation i at least wish we got a swivel there because he's still eight dollars so they could have at least given us three rings like come on or a few more at least but uh yeah uh would i recommend this well, try, I guess. It's a pretty nice figure. Figure, not action figure. Because this doesn't qualify as an action figure. To qualify as an action figure, you need at least five points of articulation. This guy only has three, so. Get it if you want, I guess. I don't know. But next, I think we're going to move on to the... Amazon exclusive Sonic Mighty 2 pack, and I'm gonna start off with classic Sonic. Now, this is 4 inch, as you can see. I like getting uh, 2.5 inch classic figures because they just scale better. But, uh, eh, I just bought them. Don't know why. It was before I decided on that, it just took a while to arrive, but, uh, yeah, so I'm thinking of doing two things. Uh, actually, no, I can only do one. Actually, no, two things. I'm thinking of either selling these guys, or I'm going to keep uh, them. Put them on my, the rest of my video game shelf, uh, separate from my Sonic one. Um, but yeah, besides that, this is still a great figure. Uh, nice sculpt, nice paint, well, as nice as paint as you can get with a Jax. They always have problem there. The eyes right under. That's a problem with every figure. Mighty, there you go. Uh, okay, Metal Sonic is clean. And, uh, Sonic, they only seem to have that problem with white. Because the same for every other character who doesn't have white eyes. So I just don't understand it. But yeah, this is still probably like my favorite classic Sonic figure. I had another classic Sonic figure before. Uh, he was like... He had noodle arms. Not noodle arms, but they were like... Bended up a bit. It was like the exact same thing, but the arms were bended. And I hated it. It was sticking out, but this is nice down to the side. Nice normal stance. You can get nice running poses with it. It's a lot more useful than whatever they were cooking there. 
but uh yeah for articulation he has i think that's a ball joint yeah it's a ball joint but you don't really get much range out of that here at the arms you get a switch what the hell what the hell what the heck Boy ain't no way, boy. But but boy ain't no way, boy. Boy ain't no way, boy. But but boy ain't no way, boy. Swivel at the arm. Can go up that much, uh, down that much. Ball joint at the hand can go all the way around. Here at the leg, you can go forward, you can go back that much. If you tilt the legs this way, you can get a beautiful last spread. You can get that much with the knee and ball joint there. And for an accessory, you came with a spring. Uh, I guess that would, I guess that's what glue's for. <laughs> I'm scared now. Uh, we got mighty. I'll just get the accessory out of the way. This is a pretty awesome ass accessory. It's a item box, coin, Bitcoin. Pretty cool accessory, I like it. So very interesting. <laughs> oh no. But yeah, there's a very nice paint sculpt. I never really liked how uh, Mighty had that super long nose. But uh, it looks nice. For, for the articulation, you have a swivel at the head. Well, there's a bull drip. You get literally nothing else with that. The arms go all the way around, up, down, swivel a little ball joint there. Here at the leg, whew, here at the legs forward, nice back, turn to the side, you go out that far, knee crunch, and ball joint there. Uh, so yeah, thank god this guy didn't break on me. Like, SONIC THE HEDGEHOG! But, uh... Yeah, Mighty's a nice figure. I'm definitely keeping him. He's the main reason I bought it anyway. This sucks, though. I guess, that, I guess that's what glue was made for anyway. But yeah, I like Mighty. Alright, uh, so moving on. I don't have the figure for this. This is really like an old slime figure, but I got spikes here. Yeah, that's it, but... Anyway, next we got a super cool find. Was really not expecting to find this today. We have Metal Sonic Mark III. Or Metal Sonic III? I don't know, but super cool figure. Nice design. I have no idea who this guy is. He uh, came with... A red ring, but I have that somewhere. I don't know. It's somewhere though, but uh, yeah, he looks super nice. His accessory, I don't really care for it, but damn, bro, this figure is nice. He gets swivel at the head, ball joint, but again, only swivel. Uh, this arm, they have specific base, so that one goes up that much. But this one goes up a lot more. I don't like how inconsistent it is because there's actually elbow articulation. And a swivel there and a slight hinge. It's on ball joint, so you can go and play. <laughs> I hate you. This is not the best example. Of why Jax makes the best Sonic figures. <laughs> I have a 
this batch, bro. I got all the manufacturing errors, but uh, yeah, other than that, <laughs> it's the same. Uh, legs go up that much, they go back like all the way. Holy shit! Uh, knee goes up. Holy, she can kick his metal ass tur turbine. There's also a swivel there. Same here. You can get that much. Holy shit. And swivel there. So. Than <sighs> that. This figure is amazing. This is probably. Like. Right up there with Mecha Sonic. As the best. Jack figure in my collection. Uh, but yeah. And finally. We got Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh, yeah. And this is the... Yeah, I got him. Uh, this one comes with that. They actually had all of this, whatever this wave was, with the classic four-inch knuckles, which was there. I was debating on getting it, but maybe next time. But they didn't have the fucking Heavy King. That's the only, literally... Other than Metal Sonic, that's the only figure I wanted from this wave. And they don't have it! Ugh. Uh, but yeah. Get a swivel there at the head. No up and down. You get a swivel here at the arm. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared, Dad. I'm scared. You go up that much. Uh, nothing here at the elbows. They really... You can do it with your mecha figures. Do it with... The, do it with the rest of them. Give them damn elbow joints. That's all you're missing. Not cool, dude. All you need is elbow joints. And your figures are the best. Still the best Sonic figures, though. Uh, mostly. But, uh... There is also... Crappy ass seam line. Shut up. Uh, but yeah, you get that much forward, that much back. All the. <laughs> please, please, please. Uh, holy, ho 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 holy moly. Here at the knee, you cannot kick his hedgehog ass. And ball joint there, and also ball joint at the hands. I don't think I. I don't think I mentioned that. But, uh, yeah, he's a pretty nice figure. Definitely not the... It, not the best Sonic figure, though. <gasps> I know, right? This video is called Why Jax Makes the Best Sonic Figures Part 2. Um, looks-wise, yes... Quality control. No. There's literally no qual like there is quality control, but I Ugh. There's actually nothing wrong with Mighty. Oh, wait. <laughs> That's a problem with all of them. Except the only figures they can get right is Mecha. And even then, they can't get that shit right, bro. Why does this one go up more? Uh, but yeah. If you want really accurate Sonic figures on your shelf, this, this is obviously the best. But if you want, like... If you want figures to give to your kids, you're gonna have a. Again, like no, no Sonic brand that I know makes like good quality control. Like Jazzwares, Tommy had decent. They they were not perfect though. They didn't even make half the fucking roster. Um But yeah, it's 
if like ten dollars, fifteen dollars each, it's it's passable. It's only like it's more worth it than a thirty dollar Marvel Legend. You don't even get a single fucking accessory. So it's more worth it than that. No, thirty five dollars here in Canada. Sorry, but uh. I'm gonna go glue this now. See you guys in that. That really depressed me, bro. I was so hyped to make this video too. Just killed the hype. You killed the hype!